Hello and welcome to another ZX Zillions of Anime X unboxing today with the newest set E46. And yeah, I am super excited for this release. It has again some awesome artworks. I I saw a few of the the preview spoilers for this release and it made me yeah even more exciting since I, I do collect the prayer beast characters, which is basically like a a certain tribe in, in this anime, TCG, which are highly inspired by ancient Egyptian goddesses. And there are at least three, yeah, there are three sadly lower rarities. Uh, yeah, new cards of, of the prayer goddess or prayer beast characters. So I hope I can pull them. There should be also holographic versions of one or two of them, not from all, I guess. But unfortunately, there are no really high hits, like no secret rares or no MGNRs. I was really hoping for some some awesome high rarity uh, Egyptian goddesses, like in the past. But it's it's some time ago that we at least got a got one of these characters as a high hit. And I turned my light off, and this was really stupid, so I turned it on again. So yeah, this is a LR, uh, no, not a LR, it has the LR foiling, which is like this cold foiling, but it's uh, super rare. So yeah, recently they did change again. It feels like every, every few sets they change something with the rarities, and every time when I think, oh, now I figure it out, now I know, like, which are uh, the rarities and in which order they are, and these are the highest ones, and uh, you can expect these rarities from a box guaranteed. They do change something again. So, yeah. yeah. And this is just a, a rare card, but interesting, revealing artwork. And from yeah, from all the shatter foiling in TCGs, I think the, the foiling in ZX looks quite nice. But so far, not even like, oh man, I hope I can at least get the regular versions of the Egyptian goddesses. They are in the, they are always in the color identity of yellow. I don't know if this has a, a special name in ZX as a region or yeah in the game but this is not a rare this is the n in foil and yeah recently with the last booster pack release like this is the extra booster pack the e and the recent booster pack i it felt like we get less hits maybe i was just unlucky but it it felt like we are not getting as much high textured hits as in the past. I don't, I don't know. It's a little bit difficult to find information, at least for me. There are probably a lot of people like in the in Japan who know uh, how the, the changes affect uh, the new releases. Okay. Now, this is the first, the first Egyptian goddess, and this is Sebeku. Uh, so S E B Q. So so Sobek or Sebek. Uh, if I remember it correctly, I think it was like a a goddess with a crocodile head. I'm not super sure. I think it was. But yeah, the first of the characters I was looking for, and we get a S S R. Cute. But yeah, SSR is basically like the the WR rarity in the past. It's the shatter foiling with some additional gold stamping of the frame or the numbers in the name. I guess it's like one. Okay, this is the second one. This is Anubisu. This is Anubis. And in the past, we got some other Anubis cards, which I, yeah, I, I don't think I've picked up every card of her already, but recently I, I ordered some single cards from Japan and 
yeah, there are a lot of like symbols uh, on this character, like the the Ang symbol. Uh, the there's another like Shen was it? I think it's another like knot symbol, and of course we have like the sun disc and the the cobra. Awesome artwork. I I, I hope I can. Yeah, I, I guess I cannot hope since uh, chances are pretty low to pull these three cards in foil. But I I guess I have to pick up the single cards in foil. Of course, I need them in foil. I'm always going for for the fancy versions. Get like some dragons, okay? And the, another SR. I have the dragon. Finally, it reminds me a little bit, maybe if you are familiar with uh, Miss Kobayashi's Dragon Maid. Uh, the dragon reminds me a little bit of uh, Kana in dragon form. From the, I don't know, it gives me like Kana vibes. I think she's also like, is she like white or pinkish? I don't know. And what do we have here? Is it this, this snake? Snake with a katana? That's a cool artwork. Okay, and we get these O O F Rs. No, I think they changed it again. O B. Yeah, we get the the top part and the last one. So yeah, now we have all all three in the regular versions. I I, I can't read this. This these are like kanjis. There's like Nino. Like I can read the the Karaganas at the end. It's Ni and No. But I can't read the rest. Oh yeah, the, the last. The last one of the three. I don't know if all of them are available in foil. I guess so, but I'm not sure. But yeah, I, I hope we get at least like one more high hit. Another dragon. Like a double rare would be my guess. No, another SR dragon. And the dragon is already like pretty dark, purple, and the foiling makes it even darker. Like, I, I'm really not a fan of this, the, the LR rarity, like this cold foiling. But let's hope for some last pack magic, since this is the last booster pack. It's just an, okay, it's an SR. It's so confusing. Like this is an SR, it has the, the cold foiling, like the the regular SRs, but it, it has also the gold stamping. So from the foil treatment and yeah, from the design, it's basically like the revolution rare. It's it's the same. But really cool artwork. The pose she's striking and yeah, preparing for an attack. Really cool character design. Love the, the flow. But yeah, we got all three. I think, I guess it's guaranteed. Like, you should get, like, most of the the basic hits. But yeah, sad, sadly not in foil. So, yeah. So, thank you for watching. Let's end with a Force of Will pack. And yeah, I, I do hope, like, to to inspire, like, or to to make it more interesting for people to, to see ZX. Since, yeah. It's still a very niche TCG, but I, I think it has some great artworks and great cards, even if I don't know how to play with them. But yeah, thank you for watching and see you in my next unboxing. Bye.